between stutters. The countermeasure was Paul's prize. Everything he'd built was based on Will's device. His plan depended on it. You better believe I look forward to taking it from him. Paul spent a long time running Monarch in secret. Probably didn't help with that whole disconnected from reality thing. Only one of Serene's treatments survived the explosion. His time was running out. So was everybody else's. What happened to you? Looks like you ran into that creepy thing. Seventeen years, he lived through twice. All of it mapped out, for memory. He knew the market trends before they occurred. He had the tools to make a fortune, and he did. Paul told me that he tried to change things, failed. What he'd seen, it broke him. And I'd seen Beth go down the same path, but Paul, it consumed him. supposed to be wearing that. Uh, uh, no, look, Joss, I can explain. Joss, we, we, Wheeler, I'm, I'm tech support. No, seriously, just put the gun down, man. I'm, I'm just here. Joy! Help! Charlie, get, get it down! Get Charlie. Yeah, yeah. Let me get this door open. The lifeboat revolved around the countermeasure. He knew Will would try to take it back. That's why he was killed. He knew I'd try to do the same eventually. Clearly, he was right. They'd stockpiled all the chronon particles from Ground Zero to keep the lifeboat running. Enough to hopefully last until a proper solution was discovered. There you go, Joyce. You're just hoping you know what the fuck you're doing. Yeah, me too. Yeah, well, there it is. CFR, countermeasure, whatever it's called. Help yourself, Joyce.
Got it? Can we get the hell out of here? Something had gone down in that chamber before I arrived. Whatever it was, it was bloody. I'd seen the dead guy before. Liam Burke. What the hell happened? It took 11 years for Will to build the countermeasure. Beth died for it, and I knew it could fix the fracture. This fucking thing. Problem was, I didn't have a clue how to use it. The only person who did was dead. But Monarch had a way of getting to him before that ever happened. The university time machine. They've got the core here. Can we go or what? I need to get to the chamber above. No problem. Got a way up right here. Thanks for the help. No biggie. Make it count. Yeah. You're not coming? No, I gotta get back down. Someone I really want to get back to. Good luck, Joyce. Yeah. Hey, why are you going up there anyways? Short version? I gotta go back in time and save my brother. <laughs> You're gonna go back in time, yeah, right. Whatever. You don't have to tell me, I guess. Paul took the core of the time machine from the university, hooked it up to his own machine. It was part of his sick desire for control, but that gave me one last shot at fixing things. I could go back, maybe get to Will before Paul killed him. And if I could get the countermeasure in Will's hands, maybe I could still turn everything around. The core was set, the machine was prepped. I had to put the corridor in place. Okay, this should do it. Deploying the corridor. Phase one underway. Please clear all personnel from the Oh my god,
you're welcome, you very slow machine lady. The machine was ready. I just needed to put in the date. The earliest I could go back to was the time that the Corps was first activated. At the university. Not much time to rescue your brother. I didn't have a choice. I got there after the fracture initiated. Too late to stop it all before it ever started. But not too late to save Will. All you had to do was get to him in time. Yeah, that was the plan. HQ, we've got security footage of the Joyce brothers escaping through the server room on the lower level. Raider Team 3, intercept immediately. Ready another extraction unit to remove the core. Prowler Team, ready the heavies in the underground parking. I'm not hearing any response from Raider Team 3. That extraction we team? may have a situation. We're supposed to have the core Copy. loaded in that chopper box. I remember that Will and I were heading to the courtyard when the stutter hit. That's where I needed to cut him off. Courtyard. How do I get there? You never tried to stop Monarch from extracting the core. The fact that they stole it was the only reason I was able to return to the past. It's not a logic I wanted to mess around with.
When Will and I had escaped from the lab after the experiment, it seemed like Monarch was dealing with somebody other than us. That was me, all along. You get on. Probably because I'm not rocking those ugly astronaut pants. Hatches orders. Six six five. Neighbor of the beast, you know. All right. Six six five. Okay. <laughs> here ain't left yet. How the fuck did Joyce take out those strikers? He's obviously not alone. Go shoot it!
shit. I got orders to control the We gotta beat him to the library. We already got men up there. And they want more. Take it up the steps. I got orders to control Come on, gotta move. 
Jack. Yeah. You saved me. Uh, welcome back. <laughs> hey, Will. Here's a present. Uh, a countermeasure. How? Oh, Jack. Will! Come on! Come on, uh, let's go. Ah. Monarch had it the whole time. Does it work? Came back from the future. For me. Fracture wasn't fixed. Not yet. Does it work? Theory, yes. We gotta get back to my time machine. We gotta get us back to the time where you came from. No, future. No, 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 no. It's the only way. We need to stop the fracture here, in this time. Now. Oh, Jack, listen to me. The fracture wasn't fixed in the time where you came from. So fixing it here, it's always gonna fail. People are going to die, Will. You haven't seen what happens between now and then. No, but you have. What you have done has set in motion a chain of events that cannot be broken. Look, we don't know And if it could be broken, it could jeopardize the entire world. If we get one shot at this, there's too much at stake, Jack. Look, I know the stakes, okay? Then you gotta let go, Jack. Everything you have done to get to this place is necessary. Trust me. The past is set. This way. If what you said is true, then how did I save you? I saw you die, Will. Think, Jack. You never physically saw me die, did you? I watched a roof collapse on top of you. Creating the illusion of my death, yes. Which brought you here to make sure it remained only an illusion. It's all a loop. If time is an egg, then... No egg metaphors. I need some air. Cleaners better get here quick. Wait, wait for them to leave. Now, I know it's a lot to take in, but the fact that you managed to save me and yet still maintain the illusion of my death is actually further proof of my point. Risk the past remains intact. Stick to the plan. Nothing changes, so and the Novikov self-consistency principle prevails. Oh, great. We can high-five about that later. Right. Let's save the world first. Come on. Let's meet up with the convoy. Okay, they're gone. Let's go. Surprised you actually waited. It's almost like you're listening to me. Well, the last time I didn't listen to you, the fracture occurred. Consider me open to following orders. Huh. That doesn't sound like my brother. I know. All right, through here. We can't risk helping them. I know what happens if I don't. And it'll still happen, Jack. I meant what I said back there. And there are no exceptions. If you get suckered into trying to change what can't be changed, it may cost us everything. Please, Jack. Our future depends on this. You said Monarch had the countermeasure this whole time. How? Why? Paul was using it to fuel some kind of messed up survival program. Uh-huh. They must have somehow repurposed it as a localized Cronon field regulator. I always assumed it was Beth Wilder who had the countermeasure, keeping it safe. She was the one who warned me, told me to build it. I know. You met her. Is she helping us? She was. Ah, I see. Oh, shit, watch out. <laughs> 